Hello everyone! Welcome back to our channel 100 Ideas. Gazebos, Rotondas, Pavilions There is always a place for a gazebo on large and small plots. It will protect you from the rain, hide you from the strong wind, and hide you from the hot sun. This is beautiful and practical design for relaxation, which can be used as a central element in the arrangement of relaxation areas on the site. A good place for this is a garden or the shore of a pond. These types of small architectural forms are made with open or closed walls, with roofs of different shapes, made of metal, wood or stone. If the territory is large, you can put several gazebos or a pavilion. It is convenient if you often plan to gather a large company to relax with a barbecue. For territories in the classical style with a large house, a rotunda, a round-shaped gazebo with supports in the form of a columns is suitable. If the recreation area is combined with a residential one, then you can attach a canopy made of wood or metal to the house. Combined options look interesting, for example metal racks can be decorated with fabric, and climbing plants and shrubs planted along the perimeter of the gazebo, pavilion or canopy will additionally decorate the structures and strengthen their function of shelter. Pergolas and arches. In order to delimit the territory into separate zones and decorate the site, arches are used. They can be metal, wooden and less often stone or concrete. They are often covered with climbing vegetation. Several such connected arches form a pergola. Externally, this structure resembles a green tunnel. It is convenient for dividing the territory and creating protection from the sun. For this purpose, this type of small architectural forms is placed between the house and the gazebo or pool.
Have you been thinking about a gazebo in the garden for a long time, but still do not dare to create a complex and time-consuming project? A covered light building on the territory of your landscape for recreation can be created even from improvised materials. See for yourself using pellets. Wooden pellets are most often manufactured and used in one of five models. The most popular type of wooden pallet is the so-called Hero pallet with dimensions of 1200 on 800 mm. However, in addition to this, other pallets of 1200 on 1000 mm and 1200 on 1200 mm are used on the market. But some products, especially high consumption, wooden pellets of 800 on 600 are often used. They are called semi-pellets because they make up half of a standard European pellet. According to the definition, a pellet is a package for the transportation and storage of goods and products. However, this material is suitable for creating practical garden structures, for example, a full-fledged gazebo. Of course, first of all, you should be able to evaluate your manual labor skills. Then it will be much easier to understand if you can handle the job when it comes to building a gazebo. As a result, you can find many interesting projects using a hammer or a screwdriver. If we have a little more skill, you will successfully cope with complex structures made of pallets. Pallets are an improvised material that can often be found completely free of charge. Ready-to-use wood will be an excellent raw material for creating a gazebo. It can be lightly sanded and create a simple shelter from the sun for your dacha. Eco-friendly and natural material will fit perfectly into the natural landscape. In such a building, it will be comfortable to rest on hot summer days. Pallets can become your main raw material that you will use when creating a small garden architecture. It is good if they are attached to a wooden floor, because it is not difficult to guess that the material is not particularly durable. Some projects consist of whole pallets. In this case, you may notice the characteristic shape of bulky boards. In other variants, pallet splitting is definitely common. Then, for example, you can create a more holistic design. We hope this video was useful to you. Like it, write your comments and subscribe to our channel.